This here's a 400EX front sprocket mod. Hopefully it works. Uh, you can see the teeth here are stripped out for using this. So there's no way to align it and have the teeth hold on. It's stripped out. Uh, the shaft's pretty hard, so to drill and tap it. Uh, but what I made was a slug right here and then kind of a washer, aluminum washer. To, it's going to butt up against there once it's tight and it'll still allow it to free float. There was a snap ring on here from the previous owner. You can see it broke already. That was on here and then they tightened the uh, this up to there, pulling the sprocket tight up against the, the uh, snap ring and it's binding the chain and that's not how it's supposed to work. It's supposed to free float. So try this out. Okay, so I got it all tack welded up. Be better if I could have uh, tigged it. But it's not the prettiest, but it'll work. So this is counterboard right here, just enough to allow this to free float. So go ahead and screw it on here. Actually, uh, put a dab of Loctite on it, along with the lock washer. Thread that in there. It's just a quick mod before I, I'm gonna end up washing it after this. Make sure it's good with a road test. Tighten this up with an Allen wrench. I drilled and tapped that slug to an M6 just to keep everything metric. Okay, so now that's on there and it's tight and it allows the sprocket to move around like it should back and forth it's not holding it up tight for the way it was and it's stripped out so rather than replacing the whole uh, counter shaft split in the cases uh, this seems to work pretty good I'm running down the road but that way you just undo that change your sprocket you're good to go Uh, take it for a quick road test make sure everything's good to go and uh, let you guys know but uh, hopefully this works for you or um, you could try to find this mod somewhere I didn't see it nowhere so I just made this up myself and figured it's worth a shot rather than splitting the case thanks for watching